You've just landed at Frankfurt, and welcome to Germany, by the way, but how do you get from the airport to the city? Well, of course, you could just take a taxi, but if you want to save a little bit of money, I'm going to show you how to do it by public transport. Now, I'm on the visitor's terrace, which is at Terminal 2, but to get the trains, we need to go to Terminal 1, so let's do that. First, let's be clear about which airport we're talking about. This is Frankfurt's main international airport and not Frankfurt Hahn Airport, where most of the budget airlines fly to. That airport is halfway to Luxembourg, but this one is just outside of Frankfurt itself. So we're at Terminal 2 and we need to get to Terminal 1. Now it's actually within walking distance, or there are free shuttle buses available, but we're going to take Frankfurt Airport's people mover, the Skyline. There is currently a new Terminal 3 under construction, which the Skyline is going to be extended to, so at least this part of the video is future-proof. The railway stations are accessible from Terminal 1 Concourse B and are clearly signposted. And yes, you may have noticed that's stations in the plural, one for regional trains and one for long distance trains. If you find yourself going down this passageway, it's actually taking you to the long distance trains. Now, some of them will take you to Frankfurt, but you can't use the local public transport tickets on them. You should arrive here, where you'll find a number of ticket machines. Local public transport tickets for Frankfurt are issued by a tariff association called the RMV. You should be able to get RMV tickets from any machine, but you're less likely to make a mistake if you choose the green ones. A single trip ticket will allow you to travel into Frankfurt. Transfers are allowed, but not round trips, and you can't interrupt your journey. If you are going to be using public transport to get around Frankfurt, the day ticket will always be the best option. Tickets are valid for all local public transport, buses, trams, U-Bahn, S-Bahn and local commuter trains in the entire city of Frankfurt. There are no ticket barriers in Germany, which does mean that it's easy to accidentally get on without a valid ticket. But unlike most cities in Germany, paper tickets in Frankfurt don't need to be stamped before they're valid. Any ticket bought from a ticket machine is valid for immediate travel. Now all you need to do is to go down to track 1, clearly signed for trains into the city. There is an S-Bahn train every quarter of an hour, which is bound for either Hanau or Offenbach Ost. But if you know you're only going as far as the Hauptbahnhof, which is the main central station, you can take an RE train if one happens to be scheduled. This is a map of Frankfurt's S-Bahn and U-Bahn network showing just how close the airport is to the city. On the S-Bahn, the fourth stop is the Hauptbahnhof, and at this point I should mention that at time of filming there was extensive upgrading work in progress at many of the stations. At the moment things look a bit unwelcoming and unpleasant, but if you're watching this a few years in the future, it now looks amazing. Anyway, if you are catching a long-distance train from the Hauptbahnhof, this is where you get off and go upstairs to the mainline platforms. But if you're looking to see the sights, you can instead change here for the U-Bahn. Look for the platform for trains to Poingersheim, Bornheim and Enkheim and take any train from there two stops to Dom Römer. This takes you straight into the heart of Frankfurt's historic centre. Alternatively, if you stay on the S-Bahn, you can get off at either Hauptwache or Konstablerwache. These stations are at opposite ends of the Zeil, Frankfurt's main shopping street. So, well done. You've found your way here, you had a great time, but how do you get back to the airport? Well, by now you're an expert at using Frankfurt's public transportation system, so this part is easy. You need to be careful of one thing. If you buy a ticket anywhere in the city and you need it to take you to the airport, make certain you choose the correct option. Tickets that are valid also for the airport are a bit more expensive than those that are valid only for the city. From anywhere in central Frankfurt, you just need to find your way to any station on the S-Bahn tunnel. And from there, you can take either the S8 or the S9 bound for Wiesbaden. But be careful here. The S1 also goes to Wiesbaden, but it does not go via the airport. So here is a quick diagram showing the important routes in simplified form from the airport to the main central station, the finance district, the shopping district and the historic centre. I'll also link to the RMV's official website which has information in English, Spanish, Turkish, Italian and French. 
I hope you found this video helpful. While you're in Frankfurt, you might want to see some of the less well-known sites. I made a video about this a while back, which I'll link to in the description.